Well, hello there. Well, I've been in Florida for a lot, a lot of years. Um, I travel all over the states. I have other residents in other places. But I've been around the Florida, state of Florida for over 30 years. So, uh, I've been around during hurricanes, storms, tornadoes, all kinds of stuff. And, uh, anyway, uh, today's, uh, vlog is about Hurricane Dorian, Florida. So, where do we go? Uh, well, if you're worried about it hitting you, um, uh, I would be kind of worried if I was down in Miami. Um, but if you're real worried... Uh, I would go ahead and and plan a day or two off and uh, schedule a hotel somewhere long away from the the northeast area if it does hit. The thing is they can die before they hit ground and they can turn the other way. So uh, you just need to watch that weather report, check out the weather channel, put it on your phone. Look at it in the morning and look at it at night um, because it's days away. Uh, now, there will be some storming and stuff before it actually hits as it gets closer to Florida. But, um, uh, you know, if you want to get prepared and you're real worried about it, then here's what I would do. I would get on the Internet or call around to Fort Walton, Florida, or Destin, Florida. Now, Destin's always going to be real high. It, Destin's usually double the price of Fort Walton for hotels. And right now, for the week of September 1st through the 8th of 2019, there's lots of hotels for under $100 in the Fort Walton, Destin, Florida area. So, uh, all you need is, like, state ID, um, bring some cash. Uh, I don't like to reserve credit cards unless I use a prepaid credit card on a hotel. Um, I try to get them to take my cash, and that way I can get my cash back when I go to leave. But, um, uh, there's plenty of them. You can look on Trivago, Kayak, all kinds of, of internet locations for hotels. And sign up for a hotel, get guaranteed rates, this, that, the other. Um, I have friends that will not even use hotels. They like to use the, the Airbnb. They can get whole suites and condos, dirt cheap, um, cheaper than, than getting a hotel. And the other option is, of course, to go to the casinos. Those are the cheapest and best hotel, hotel deals in the world. If it's time for your vacation to take a break, I would go to like Biloxi or or go up into Missouri to the casinos up there. Um, but uh, that's a good game plan for where do you go? And I would go ahead and start checking it out now and reserve something so that you don't have to to worry. Um, you know, don't don't stress the small stuff. And then even if the if the storm does take a turn or die before it hits ground, which you need to watch when it gets about 40 miles of, of ground, that's when you need to really watch because there's a real high chance that it will hit, you know. Um, so, uh, but I mean, again, sometimes it dies right before it hits ground. So, but if you're worried, I would do that and I would get going on it right away so that you can get your reservations in because that's what happens is a lot of people will leave at the last minute and you can't get out. They take the expressways um, instead of taking, you know, the side roads. Um, and then there's no fuel. And then by that time, there's no power or anything else. And, and you don't know how long it'll take till that's restored. Um, I mean, Panama City, they're still repairing all that from the last hurricane. Uh, and that's been over a year. So, um, but it's been many, many years since Panama has been hit like that. And, of course, Fort Walton and Destin I really haven't been hit hard in a hurricane since, like, the 80s, the early 80s. So, um, check it out. 
And really, the easiest option is just like getting to fight. What do you do? Get away from it. So, um, you know, if you're worried about a storm, get away from it. Real simple solution. Um, but uh, and don't wait till the last second. That's just not real smart because you're not the only one that's decided to leave at the last second. So, anyway, uh, I hope you have a great day and. Be safe. Not sorry. Love to you.